Welcome back to our channel, the channel for the latest news and untold stories about Catherine, the Princess of Wales, and her royal family. Today, we bring you fashion news. Catherine's subtle fashion sense steal people's hearts as she dazzles at an ethereal wedding outfit. Whenever I, a fashionable blogger, gaze upon photos from the wedding of the monarch or at the Princess Catherine's bridal attire, I'm shocked and impressed. Many readers of my stylish site have remarked about how chic Princess Catherine looked at both her friends and the royal wedding. The Sultan of Brunei announced on Sunday that his eldest son, Prince Abdul Mateen, would marry Anisha Isa Kalabik during the first months of 2024. Following his sister Princess Fadzila and Princess Azmia sealed the marriage at the beginning of 2022 and 2023. Accordingly, the 32-year-old Prince Abdul Mateen becomes the sole surviving child of the Sultan, along with his previous second wife, Hajra Miriam Abdulaziz. Princess Catherine's exquisite taste in clothing will be on full display for everyone to see once again, and as we are a species, we will undoubtedly get to see an additional of those tiara-wearing moments that every fashionista dreams about. Please allow me to take you on a trip down memory lane as I show you a few of the wedding outfits that Princess Catherine has worn to amaze her royal admirers and style aficionados. Be sure to catch this final one because you will go wild with her fashion sense. It's been 12 years when Prince William and Princess Catherine, now the Princess of Wales, tied the knot at Westminster Abbey in London. Her stunning nine-foot train and lacy bodice containing intricately embroidered blossoms attracted the attention of nearly 26.3 million viewers in the country of England alone. Following that time, the Princess of Wales has attended other royal weddings in Sarah Burton creations, notably the weddings of her brother and sister-in-law, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Catherine has been named Best Dress Attendee at many weddings in consecutive years because of the impeccable craftsmanship of McQueen. The Princess of Wales' conscientious attitude to fashion means that she often chews tried and tested items from her closet while attending elite ceremonies. Although her McQueen design exudes the understated majesty that the globe has come to anticipate from the international icon and longtime champion for British design, Catherine demonstrates a conscientious attitude towards royal style by accessorizing her McQueen suit with repurposed L.K. Bennett sledge heels and vintage Natalie handbag purse. The Princess of Wales is a shining example of what it means to be a chic wedding attendee. May 2017 Catherine ordered a one-of-a-kind fuchsia creation by Sarah Burton to serve as the celebratory reception after her sister Pippa Middleton's wedding to James Matthews at St. Mark Cathedral in Englefield Green. She wore a Jane Taylor headpiece alongside a bouquet of flowers tucked in its center. Jean Vito Rossi 105 shoes in praline suede among others, as well as Kiki McDonough's Morganite Jewel Drop jewellery with a delicately ruffled outfit. May of 2018. After taking some time off to have her third child, Prince Louis, the Princess of Wales reappeared to see Meghan Markle becoming the Duchess of Sussex by marrying Prince Harry. Catherine appeared put together with a fitted McQueen coat in pale yellow, a headpiece by Philip Treacy, and paired shoes by Jimmy Choo. The present tense, the Princess of Wales donned a raspberry-coloured McQueen outfit along with an appropriate Philip Treacy headpiece to see Princess Eugenie go along to the church and marrying Jack Brooksbank at St. George's Church. The deep colour was a welcome departure from Catherine's usual attire as an official wedding attendee. The Queen's diamond necklace added a touch of regal history to her contemporary velvety Prada handbag and shoes. In July of 2011, Catherine wore a golden brocade fabric day berger and Mickelson coat dress, along with a Gina Foster millinery's hitting law system place hat to the marriage ceremony of Zara Phillips and Mike Tyndall during the Canongate Kirk in the Scottish capital. Catherine's favourite L.K. Bennett sled shoes and high street design, Natalie Purse, were among the other highlights at the evening's festivities. In picturesque Switzerland, during March of 2013, Catherine wore a subdued blazer over a Patton Max Mara studio outfit for the marriage ceremony of Lorja Beschensheimer and Mark Tomlinson. Her wintertime ensemble was jazzed up with a Betty Boop style hat from Lock & Company. Along with her modest elegance was maintained with the chocolatey Valerie footwear plus a Natasha purse from Emmy Footwear. Both Lucy Mead and Charlie Budget looked stunning in flowery whistles gowns and turquoise and Missoni jackets from their March 2014 wedding. 
Catherine wore a monochrome outfit to St. Mary's the Virgin Cathedral in Marshfield, accessorizing with a Bayswater pocket and Cassandra gold flower earrings. May 2013, Prince William accompanied his buddy William Van Kutzum at his wedding to Rosie Rock Keane at Awelm, Oxfordshire. Catherine, who was expecting Prince George for the initial time, donned a black and white polka dot pregnancy outfit from Topshop, a black leather Ralph Lauren jacket, white heels from Episode, and an accompanying leather purse. The month previously, she had donned her understated dress on a Warner Brothers trip. Hugh Van Kutzum and Rose Astor, 2005. Princess Catherine, while dating Prince William, goes to Burford, England's Burford Parish Chapel, to witness the marriage of Hugh Van Kutzum, King Charles's Cambridge buddy, as well as Rose Astor. During the social marriage ceremony, youthful Catherine wears a black fascinator with a creamy jacket, along with black and creamy miniskirt. 2006, for Laura Parker Bowles and Harry Lopez's marriage. Catherine attends the marriage ceremony of Laura Parker Bowles, Queen Camilla's child, and Harry Lopez in Wiltshire in the United Kingdom, wearing a cream-coloured overcoat dress and an accompanying striking fascinator. Dame Rose Windsor and Mr. George Gilman around 2008. Catherine, who's a great relative, shows up to the London marriage of Lady Rose Windsor, as well as George Gilman's glowing. She accessorises her typical long, frizzy hairdo by sporting a black feathery fascinator. Alice Haddon Patton, as well as Nicholas Van Kutzum's wedding. During the marriage nuptials of Nicholas Van Kutzum, Hugh's son, and he married Alice Haddon Patton, Catherine wearing an aqua Jane Troughton jacquard clothing and speaks alongside a companion. Harriet Mead and Rosetta Bradford wedding in 2010. Prince William and Princess Catherine attend the marriage ceremony of Harry Mead and his partner Rosie Bradford near North Leach in the UK. Supposedly married at the moment, the news hadn't been made official until quite yet. According to reports, Catherine's ceremony attire had been identified as a cobalt-coloured silken Issa creation. Bella Borlin and Sam Whaley Cohen, wedding in 2011. Princess Catherine visits Berkshire County in the United Kingdom for the marriage ceremony of her close companion Sam Whaley Cohen with Bella Barlin, just a few months following their own nuptials. The straightforward black and white garment became infamous after being published on the continuous cover of Newsweek. 2011. Mike Tyndall and Zara Phillips' wedding. Catherine dons an eye-catching green outfit to attend the wedding celebrations of Zara Phillips, Princess Anne's child and Mike Tyndall. In this photo, she can be observed during the real ceremony, sitting close to her brother-in-law, Prince Harry. Catherine, who is known for recycling her clothes, donned the same creamy coat dress twice during 2006, once to her own marriage and once when attending the marriage of Laura Parker Bowles and Harry Lopez. Mark Tomlinson and Laura Bechtelschleimer wedding in the year 2013. The marriage ceremony of William and Catherine's acquaintances Laura Bechtelschleimer as well as Mark Tomlinson brought them to Switzerland. Catherine selects a wintertime marriage ensemble consisting of a dark brown handbag and a headpiece. Emily McCorkadale and James Hutt wedding in 2012. The marriage ceremony of Princess Diana's niece, Emily McCorkadale, married James Hutt, and that was held in Grantham in the United Kingdom. Catherine attended in a Jenny Packham attire, a few of her distinctive clothes, plus a fascinator. She'd previously donned the outfit for a polo tournament in the Californian city of Santa Barbara the previous year, so it would have seemed reminiscent. However, she adds a Catherine Hooker overcoat to the outfit to attend the evening's fancy event. Princess Catherine at the marriage ceremony will take away the show for the celebration for Crown Prince Hussein and Rajwa Al Saif. Catherine wore a Jenny Packham outfit along with the Lover's Knot tiara for the quintessential exquisite nighttime appearance. Catherine stunned while wearing a Jenny Packham Golden Georgia gown featuring sequined embellishments. When she attended the Royal Variety Show in London, she wore an olive coloured version of the exact same dress. Catherine completed the ensemble by adding the Lover's Knot tiara, a Prada purse, plus her Dame Grand Cross of the Royal Victorian Order sash the night before. Thanks for watching today's video. If her choice of wedding guest attire chic, and how is it in your opinion? What do you think of the idea of her wearing a tiara at the next royal wedding? For now, we ask that you provide feedback before saying farewell.